music that started here in Earth were people from their own, you know, their own tribes, their own places, their own country. They were only clapping. Or sometimes, I remember one time I was on a mission trip, and this was way out, way out in the island of Palawan where there's a portion there that it's, it was even published in National Geography. You know, they were all, all out, you know what I mean? And we saw them. Actually, I said, like, oops. I was feeling like I should not see this, but they had their own kind of music. The music they had, they only used those bamboos, those, um, what's called this, uh, tin, the lead of the, the uh, soda. They had all sorts. And it was so beautiful when they played the instruments. It was even so beautiful when others had to sing it. It was so beautiful. We call it in my country. There was a kind of song only. I don't think it, I have not ever noticed it in other European countries. But in Japan, I know, and in the Philippines, which I know, I'm real versed about that, they have the, what we call a kind of serenade. In my country, it's called harana. They serenade. That's the way even my brother-in-law has to do it. And also Akio did it to me. He sang my own my own Filipino song while he was serenade, while he was trying to court me through. And that's why my parents were even jealous about it. But what is really music? Music is the language of the soul. And God gave us music in our hearts. That's why I don't believe that there is such a person who said he's out of tune. Because everyone has their own tune and which God has given them very much in tune with him because music started in heaven and we had this Lucifer who had it as a choir director before. Unfortunately, because of pride, he has to be out. He was Austin and here he fell to planet Earth. But music has always been a kind of language that could even heal people or an individual who has a Parkinson. I even had a, first, a patient who had a Parkinson, and unknowingly I just played the kind of uh, concert music. And my goodness, this person suddenly became normal. So I keep on playing, and every time I was there, I keep on playing for that person. Uh, he just passed away because of old age, but music is always a kind of a medicine. Emotionally, physically, whatever. Music is always the best universal language. There was even a time that I didn't understand Achaeus' language. We only communicated through music. And we understand, besides sign language, of course. Then, of course, I had to study. But it was music who took us to the most innermost. And the same thing is music. So today, as we had invited Evans, his son Jonathan, we had invited Mr. and Mrs. Nambora. We had invited, of course, we know Lorraine, <laughs> and we know uh, Virginia. They are going to perform, and it's through music that we would like to convey to each and every one to listen to the words, because words alone can make you sing through your deepest sorrows. <laughs> 